A new arrival at the park is about to move house, but he doesn't know it yet. So given that it's not really his decision, he's hardly going to pack his own bags and chuck them into the removal van. So it's going to be down to the keepers to come up with ingenious ways to tempt him to make that move. Behind the scenes in Monkey Temple, Nadia and the team have a job to do. Today we're going to be moving Carlos from Monkey Temple to the Bat Cave. Kinkajee's a nocturnal, so he's going up to our Bat Cave to live with our Egyptian fruit bats. This morning he's been really lazy and he's just sat up on his box at the moment, so we're not sure if he'll actually come down for us, but we're going to give it a good go. Okay, he's coming down. Kinkajee's are from Latin America, where they live high in the treetops. Carlos may look like a monkey, but he's more closely related to a raccoon. What have we got here? He's a bit funky looking. He's not what you expect. Uh, he's just something a little bit different for us, so really cool to work with. Well, and he has a prehensile tail, so he can balance with his tail and swing from it. The keepers want to train their only kinkajou to enter the carrier alone. And there's one fail-safe way to get a kinkajou to drink and do what you want it to. Honey is one of their favourite things. Uh, it's really sweet and juicy for them and uh, he will do anything for it. Kinkajous love honey so much that in the wild they're not afraid to raid a bee's nest for a sugar hit. Their long, skinny tongues are perfect for honey slurping. Hi. <laughs> he's coming down now. We're hoping that he's going to come down quite amicably for us. So he's looking like he's about to go into the box for us. Oh. That was really close then. Carlos won, Nadia nil. If the guys can move him, they have big plans for Carlos. We think Carlos is about five years old, and he's just come from a family group. He was their firstborn, so he's now coming to us to hopefully start a family um, in, in the future. Second attempt. That's as far as I can do. But it seems this honey monster is all honeyed out. On the plan B. First time lucky? Great. But Carlos isn't having any of it. We'll get you, Carlos. Time to bring in the big guns. Banana might do the trick. Banana normally does the trick if nothing else will. After a long day, Carlos finally arrives at his new nocturnal abode. He's raring to go, so let's let him out. Later, I'll be finding out if the sweet-toothed kinkajou will call the Bat Cave home sweet home.